found Wonka's last golden ticket. Imagine owning the real-life Willy Wonka's empire. Giovanni Ferrero doesn't have to. He lives it. And it's not all chocolates and sweets. It's strategy, vision, and a little sprinkle of magic. Let's break it down. Based on our analysis, here are the five golden keys to Giovanni Ferrero's monumental success. In the end, Charlie Bucket won a chocolate factory. But Willy Wonka got something even better. A family. Giovanni Ferrero, the visionary behind the Ferrero Group, stands at the helm of one of the world's premier confectionery companies. Responsible for iconic products like Nutella, Ferrero Rocher, and Kinder, he has not only expanded the brand's reach, but also cemented its reputation for quality. Born into the Ferrero dynasty, Giovanni assumed leadership in 1997 and took the company to unprecedented heights. His achievements haven't gone unnoticed. According to Forbes, he ranks as the 30 the wealthiest individual globally. Yet, for all the legacy and the laurels, Giovanni's journey to success wasn't handed to him on a silver platter. The Ferrero story spans generations. And while Giovanni might have inherited the flame, he passionately fueled it, making it burn brighter than ever right here. It's Giovanni Ferrero, and his company oversees the production of Nutella, Tic Tac Mints, and of course, the Ferrero Rocher. He's an Italian businessman. Who'd have thought that being a candy connoisseur could make you so rich? We've got the story of just how Mr. Ferrero made his riches right here. Prepare for a sweet video. Hey there, just a quick moment. Hitting that like button, subscribing, and ringing the bell genuinely supports our channel. It empowers us to keep crafting stories that resonate, extracting key insights and applicable takeaways from biographies, invaluable books, and the dynamic world around us. Each click from you fuels our mission to illuminate and inspire. Thanks for being a part of this journey. Now, back to our story. In the heart of Italy, a story began that would sweep across the globe a tale as magical as Willy Wonka's enchanted factory. But this wasn't fiction. They started their expansion of the company in 1997, and within a few years, they had found reach in South America, Europe, Asia, and Australia. Unfortunately, Pietro Ferrero passed away in 2011, which left Giovanni in the sole role as CEO and leader of the family business. And boy, did he ever take up the mantle. Today, he oversees 18 production plants, which just so happened to sell the flagship product of the Ferrero Group, and arguably the closest equivalent the world has to a Wonka bar, it's the Ferrero Rocher. It was the real life journey of Giovanni Ferrero visionary leadership, Giovanni inherited a legacy as rich as the smoothest chocolate. Ferrero was already a beacon in the confectionery world with treasures like Nutella that households cherished. A treat? Well, its original name, Pasta Gianduia, was chosen as a tribute to the Italian Commedia dell'arte character Gianduia, who was a smiling Piedmontese peasant. These days, Nutella is produced in such incredible amounts that all the Nutella sold in a year could easily spread over 1,000 soccer fields. And if you think that's impressive, Ferrero purchases about one-fourth of the world's hazelnut supply every year. That is 100,000 tons of hazelnuts, folks. But Giovanni, much like Charlie when he entered the grand gates of the chocolate factory, saw a world of endless possibilities. Please enter. Balancing tradition with innovation. 
He walked a tightrope with grace, holding on to the rich traditions of Ferrero, while daring to innovate. It's as if he took a page out of Wonka's book, cherishing the age-old golden tickets, but also crafting new wonders to dazzle the world. Strategic acquisitions, but the Ferrero Empire's expansion wasn't just about making chocolates. It was a grand game of business strategy. Like a masterful player, Giovanni made moves that surprised many. Acquiring brands like Thornton's, turning them into his own Oompa Loompa that contributed to Ferrero's magic. Commitment to quality, yet in all this grandeur, Giovanni's compass remained pointed firmly towards quality. Just as Charlie was discerning about every candy he tasted in Wonka's factory, Giovanni could pick out a Nutella batch that was even slightly off. Pay attention to this clip. Learn interesting tips about Nutella. It's no secret that Nutella has some raving fans. Take World Nutella Day, for example. It was created by a woman who was so passionate about the chocolatey spread that she created a holiday for it. When the first Nutella cafe opened in Chicago, people lined up for hours to get inside. And in France, the courts recently had to stop a couple from naming their daughter after the product. Yep, everyone knows and loves Nutella. It's taken over the world. To him, every Ferrero product was a symphony, a promise of perfection. Global expansion, as the world witnessed Ferrero's wonders, it was clear Giovanni wasn't content with being a European marvel. Ferrero, the company has 25 production plants in 55 countries. Inside each of these factories, a choreograph of chocolatey sweetness takes place under the watchful gaze of employees. And the result is an enormous amount of chocolate. Just talking about Nutella, these factories pump out about 400,000 tons of it every year and use about... He envisioned Ferrero products on shelves from Shanghai to San Francisco, making the brand both globally iconic and locally cherished. A true world where, in every corner, someone could find their own golden ticket. Hey, you've got it! You've got the last golden ticket! The kids found the last golden ticket! Through this mesmerizing journey, one can't help but be inspired by Giovanni. He showed us that with vision, innovation, strategy, commitment to quality, and a global mindset. Any factory, even one not run by Willy Wonka, can create magic that the world falls in love with. In the end, the Ferrero tale is a testament to dreaming big and staying true to one's roots. If Giovanni's journey has struck a chord with you, Consider this your golden ticket to dive deeper into stories that inspire. Hit that like button, share this sweet tale with your friends, and don't forget to subscribe! Together, let's unwrap more stories of success and savor the lessons they bring. Until next time, keep crafting your own legacy.